It's the Pit Parade, the picture story of the Pittsburgh scene from the KDK TV archives. Andrew Carnegie was having a yard sale the week of November 1st, 1957. The Carnegie Museum of Pittsburgh was auctioning off part of its collection. More than 500 art objects were on display and up for public auction at Carnegie Music Hall. Bidders could hit the bottle or mug for the camera. Even Elsie Hillman helped tag the treasures. Most of the items were gifts to the museum from the 1900s to the 1950s. It was the first public auction in the museum's 62-year history. The trolley strike wasn't history, not yet. The third week of the work stoppage had come and gone, and Pittsburgh commuters were still coming and going without too much trouble. Trouble for Pitt this week. They played Notre Dame at Pitt Stadium and logged their third loss of the season. It was Notre Dame's last minute quarterback substitution at the last minute that did in the Panthers. Leopards and spacemen and policemen and pirates were stalking the streets of Pittsburgh this week. Halloween 1957 brought out the child in all of us. Here's a look at how our imaginations ran wild this year. Things were going bump in the night the week of November 1st, 1957. Saying cheerio and video, this is Patty Burns for the Pit Parade. Look at those fun, creative costumes. Love to see those little trick-or-treaters. Watch for this look back in our KDK TV archives every week here on PTL with our Throwback Thursday look at the Pit Parade.